Hi everyone. Okay, so let me share with you my one of my crop bags. This is my main bag with my tools and stuff. So let me show it to you. It it is in response to Harumi, who is scrap and crafter here on YouTube. And um she was doing a challenge. I unfortunately wasn't able to do the challenge, but I am gonna go ahead and put out my bag the way it um what I put in it for um when I go to crops. So let me show you. This is an Anna Griffin bag and it, it does have a zipper and it has a handle here as you can see. And it did come in black and white, this color, and I could swear it came in a green color, but I'm not I, I'm not positive. So let but let me show you. This is the one that I did. Um it was gifted to me for my birthday um a couple of years ago. So let me show you what I have in it and this holds so much. These are my stickles, the ones that I take with me. They're my main stickles. And then I, I go ahead and I have one of these um, Crackle Glossy Accents, which I just use this sometimes as glue. And I have a bunch of these color box inks. So I have this one and then I have these here. I have three, six, seven, eight. And then this one, some of them have dried out already. So I've wasted them so much. Um, I've used them so much. But... As you can see up on, let's see if I can do this, up on top here, I just have my gold pen, a silver pen, a black, my white gel pen, and then I have a, a regular pen and a pencil. And then I have tools here, my X-Acto knife, some tweezers, um, this like rub-on um, tool. I have my two scissors, a Cutter B ones, a pink and the, and the yellow ones. These are just glue dots, and then I have one of these um, erasers. This is for rub-ons, and then these tweezers. And then back here I have um, the little memo pads, the, the tiny ones. In case, like, I forget to take something to a crop and I want to put it on a layout, then I'll just put that sticky note on. That's what it is, a sticky note. And then I'll write missing a pink flower or whatever it is that I'm missing. And then here, I don't know if you could see that, but I have a paper piece, piecer, piercer. Okay, so then this box that's in here, this tray, I did find that at, let me move the camera back down a little bit. This tray here, I found this at um, Target uh, um, years ago. I think it was like a dollar fifty or a dollar. I think it was when their stuff was a dollar. I'm not sure. And I have the stickles here so that they don't tip over. I also have a Bow Bunny stapler, which I have the staples here. I have my Tim Holtz scissors. You can't live with the, without those. One of these um, heart things. It's just a uh, oh gosh, what do you use this? Um, like a nail file type of thing, like to edge the um, edges. I have um, scotch tape, and then I have here my adhesives that I use on layouts and stuff. I have thin ones, thick ones, and different size ones. And then down at the bottom. I'll show you. I have, in case I'm going to be doing some brads or whatever it is and I need the paper piercer, I have this little mat. So I have that. And then, like I said, this is my main toolbox bag for my um, stuff, my stickles and everything. And nothing moves around and it closes really nice um, with the zipper, as you can see. Now, I do have... It did come with one of these that you can put it here to separate. Like if you want to put it like that sideways to separate. But I just have it here so this box won't move from where it's at. And basically that's about it. So um, thanks for watching. And Harumi, I hope that you um, can watch my video. I will go ahead and send you a message so that you can. And um, I'll talk to you guys later. Hope you guys are having a great weekend. Happy crafting. Bye.